What's up everyone, Reggie from Reggie Tech here. I hope you're all doing well and thanks for tuning into the channel. In today's video, we're gonna be taking a look at the 3M WorkTunes Bluetooth FM AM radio headset uh, headphones. This thing is awesome. So today we're gonna be unboxing it and then we're gonna be doing a little review on it and I'll also show you guys some footage of it in action in the field. Along with this, I do have a case that I bought for it. It's a nice hard case by Casling, and I'll show you guys that in a little bit, as well as the 3M battery pack that's made for this headset that unfortunately isn't included, but you can purchase it on the side in addition to the product. So with that being said, let's go ahead and get started. All right, you guys, so here we have the 3M WorkTunes headset as well as some accessories that I purchased for it. So before we get into the unboxing for this, let's take a look at the accessories. So accessory number one is the rechargeable battery. And actually, take a look at the bag that 3M sent this in. So here's the front of the bag, and here is the back of the bag where it gives you all the product information as well as the barcode and their company information. Now, once you open this baggie, we do have the actual battery itself. So here it is, lithium ion rechargeable battery pack. And this is sold separately from the headset. I kind of wish that they did include this already prepackaged with the headset, but I guess, you know, it's just the user's preference what they want to have powering this thing, regular batteries or the rechargeable batteries. Once we open up the box, I do see some uh, product paperwork here, we can put that aside. Next up we do get a USB to micro USB cable. And then we have another little package that's nicely sealed. And once we open that up, we can see the battery itself. So here's the battery. This is the, uh, the back of the battery, plus and minus for the terminals and then it has just the products uh, barcode right here. So I actually really do like the, all the effort that 3M went to uh, packaging this device. They really did a nice job of packaging it, but let's put the battery pack aside. Next up for the accessories, we do have the hard case to store this headset in when it's not in use. So let's just go ahead and rip open this bag. And here's the hard case. It's extremely nice, nice and solid. Has a nice, you know, spot to grab it from the top. Really, really nicely molded case. Uh, this is by Caseling. It is not made by 3M, but it is made for this device. Has a zipper so that you can open it up. And once you open it up, you can see that this will nicely store this product. And it also has a nice little lanyard here that you can clip onto this little hook that I just saw at the bottom. And you can also just carry it around like that. Really nice. So let's put this aside. And finally, we're up to the device itself. So right here on the front cover of the box, it gives us a ton of information. Up here it says 3M work tunes, uh, connect AM, FM, hearing protector, and then that says that in two different languages right there as well, 24 dB NRR. That is the sound specification. It says that it is Bluetooth, AM, FM, you can connect it directly to your phone, you can answer calls, and it has hi-fi sound. Uh, it says new right here, gives you a nice image of the product itself. Down here it says it contains one of the headsets and then gives you some more specifications down there. It says pro on the side. Coming up to the top, it doesn't have anything besides the little uh, kind of hanging clip. On the side of the box, we do get a lot of information actually on this product. So I'll let you guys take a quick look at that. And then on the back of the box, we get the bulk of the information as usual. There is a ton of settings and information on the different features here. So I'll let you guys take a look at this as well. Coming over to the side of the box, we get a nice little image of the side of the product with just one earphone here. It says Bluetooth again. And then on the bottom of the box, we get some more you know, warnings and precautions about the product as well as its barcode. So let's go ahead and open this thing up. Once we pull open the flap, we can just slide everything out. 
And the first thing that we can look at is the user manual. So it's actually a nice sized booklet, it comes in various different languages, up to I think three different languages in here. It just gives you all the information on how to use this, what everything does, and best practices. Next up we do have the headset itself, it comes in a nice little uh, plastic case there. And the headset has a very nice weight to it, it doesn't weigh much at all, uh, feels really nice in hand actually it feels very 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 strong and uh, feels very very durable you know sometimes you get a product and you have it in hand for the first time and you're scared to even touch it because it feels so fragile but this thing is definitely made for the working environment it feels very very robust and uh, kind of rigid in a sense very nice tension on the two metal rods holding up the earphones here and you guys can take a look at the earphones right there has some nice textured uh, sponge bits that go over your ears don't know how that's gonna feel but we'll find out in a little while and you can see here we have the little mesh over the speaker same thing on the other side we have an antenna right here that you can flex and well not really flex but you can put it up straight and that's how you're gonna receive your signal for the AM FM radio nice cushion up here at the top for your head this whole piece kind of moves so it can contour to your head and then this will adjust uh oh okay, okay. actually uh the adjustment doesn't happen at the top which it usually does for over the ear headphones but this one it actually adjusts from the headphone base itself so that's uh pretty nice and then as you guys can see it does have a wire on each side to power both speakers on this side of the speaker, we do see a nice 3M logo right there. Source button, uh, there's gonna be an LED indicator right there. Function button, as well as the dial, or the uh, volume control. On this side, we do have a spot for the battery, or if you're gonna be using regular batteries, this uses two AA batteries, so we can just put that battery inside that port once we're ready. And then I see another little uh, grommet over here over the 3.5 millimeter headphone jack as well as the charging port. So we can use a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack with this. You'll just need to get an aux cable. It didn't come in the box. I'm not sure why they didn't include that, but they didn't. Then I see here a mic kind of cutout hole. And here is the power button. A nice big <laughs> hard to miss button right here. And that button actually clicks as well so I don't really know what that does as yet but we'll find out soon and that's pretty much it for the product itself now it's time just to get this battery charged up and I'll test it out and we'll see how it works Alrighty, you guys so it's been quite some time since I did the unboxing for the 3m work tunes uh, headset now this thing I've got to say is awesome to have not only if you're doing construction or if you're around loud noises but it's also a surprisingly amazing pair of headphones. I mean, not only does this thing have a really cool appearance, this looks like some kind of steampunk design and it just gives off this really, really cool look in general. And I absolutely love that. But aside from even the sound dampening qualities that it has, it is a great pair of headphones. I can't tell you how great the sound sounds on these headphones. I could listen to music for hours and not even get tired of having this on my ears because it is super comfortable. The sponge and the little grip material here makes it comfortable to wear for long periods of time, but it also adds, you know, to that grip to your ears. So if you're moving around, it definitely won't slide around or slide off. Going back to the sound, the sound is so clear. It's like having a premium set of headphones on your ears, honestly. The, the bass is all there, the tones are all there, the clarity is all there. It's, it's just overall a great, great pair of headphones above everything else that it does. Now I know I'm talking so much about the sound quality that I get from these uh, hearing protection headphones, uh, but that's just because I'm so surprised at how great and amazing the sound sounds coming from these really, really affordable, I mean, I think these were like under 30 bucks. 
not only affordable, but it's not even really designed to be a pair of headphones. First and foremost, this is hearing protection, so it's for when you're allow around loud noises and stuff like that. But just, just the fact that they sound so good really, really did knock me off my feet when I started to listen to them. Now, aside from that sound quality that you get from these, it also does an amazing job at dampening the loud sounds that are around you. Whether you're working in a construction environment which is super loud, or you're using those power tools yourself, this definitely saves your ears from ringing later as well as potential hearing loss. Uh, while wearing these headphones, or this headset, I used it with my circular saw, which unfortunately I didn't get any footage of, but it definitely does dampen that sound. Anyone that uses circular saws knows how loud they can be. But I did get some footage using this with a cutout tool from Makita, and I'll leave that video up in the corner here if you guys wanna take a look at that cutout tool and see how it works. Um, but I also did use this with Makita's 36 volt rotary hammer drill. Now that drill is so powerful, but being as powerful as it is and being able to knock through all the concrete and masonry and everything else it can, it's extremely loud. When I had these on, and if you guys want to take a look at that video, I'll be leaving a link to it up in this corner as well. When I had the this headset on, this these headphones on, it dampened the sound so much to where I was just very, very comfortable to work uh, while using that drill and the best part is, after I was done drilling, my ears were not ringing. Uh, you know, even when I use my small subcompact uh, Makita 18 volt drill, it gets pretty loud. And it all depends also where you are. So if you're in an enclosed space like indoors or in a closet or you're drilling through a wall or something like that, it'll definitely be louder because there's an echo. When you're outside, you know, the sound gets kind of dampened because there's more area for that sound to travel and it won't be bouncing back at you as fast as it does while you're indoors. So being outside also, this does definitely, you know, shield you from all that sound. But indoors is where I think that hearing protection really does go that extra mile because of all the echoing and the sound bouncing back at you. But outside as well, super comfortable. So what I like about it, aside from the sound quality as well as the sound dampening quality, is that it's extremely lightweight. These headphones, I mean, they virtually weigh nothing. It's extremely light and when you have them on your ears, it just feels so comfortable. It has the right amount of tension so that it you know, gently grabs your face and kind of keeps it secure. Uh, and aside from that, it also does have the headband here, which does, you know, help it sit right on your head. Everything feels so comfortable while having it on, and just by putting it on there, I could barely hear myself, but, you know, hear yourself a little less than when you don't have any hearing protection on. But I've got to say, I am blown away by the 3M WorkTunes uh, hearing protection. I mean, the uh, this little antenna right here is used for that, that FM AM radio. I mean, it's kind of obvious, I guess, you know, seeing that this is, that this does have radio built right in. Um, but all the little buttons and everything, all the dials, all the switches, all the knobs, you know, everything is so easy to use and it's so user friendly. And that's what I appreciate the most with something like this, because when you're working with power tools, it can be a bit dangerous. I mean, I don't suggest, you know, listening to music or, you know, taking phone calls and giving phone calls while using power tools in general. I definitely don't because I find it very dangerous and it kind of distracts you from what you're doing. But if you do and you're comfortable with doing that, then this is perfect because everything is just an easy click, easy button, easy switch, easy knob. You can use this when you have work gloves on and that's fantastic because the buttons are big enough and you know the clicks and everything are super easy. Aside from that, aside from the buttons, it also does have the USB port down here if you want to charge it. And uh, it also does have the little headphone jack for the aux cable if you would like to use an aux cable with it. On the topic of taking phone calls, this does a great job at grabbing your voice. Your, your voice will come across to whoever you're speaking to very clearly, uh, even in a noisy environment. So that's just another great feature about these headphones. 
Now, when I did the unboxing for this, I also did the unboxing for the case as well as the rechargeable battery for this. And that rechargeable battery lasts an extremely long time. I don't think I have had to uh, recharge that within the past couple months that I've been using these. Uh, well, then again, I haven't really been using the battery all that much because I don't really listen to music while working with the headphones. Um, but the case is a must. I would say it's a must because not only is it going to protect the headphones, the headset that you have, but it just uh, makes it easier to store this. And, you know, along with the protection, you could just throw the case. It is a hard case. It will protect the headphones inside. And the case is made out of really, really nice nylon materials. The zippers are really nice and all the zippers kind of close in, which also makes it a little bit water resistant. And uh, yeah, just a great case overall. The battery, as I mentioned before, is a great battery to have. And I would definitely get it if you have these, uh, you know, this headset headphones, uh, if you're looking to listen to music and stuff with it. Uh, it's beats definitely beats uh, putting in some double A's in there and constantly having to replace batteries. It it's also a lot more you know environmentally friendly because all you need to do is recharge the batteries and not you know dispose of batteries that are wasted or uh, depleted and then add new batteries. So that is this uh, this trio in a way you know the work tunes headphones headset plus the 3M battery pack, as well as the Caseling case for the headphones, I would say this is a must if you're gonna purchase this, uh, this headset because the three of them just work so seamlessly together and uh, you know it gives you a better opportunity to take more care of this as well as to keep it clean and dust free. So I definitely do recommend if you're gonna buy this, Get three of them all at one time. It, it, I think it was a pretty affordable price when I purchased all this stuff. So I think that it is definitely worth it. It'll be worth it in the long run because it'll last a lot longer. So I think that that is about it for my review of the 3M Worktunes headset, the Caseling case, as well as the 3M battery pack. These products are awesome. If you guys want to check them out, I will be leaving links to them down in that description box below, as well as links to all the other things that you guys have seen in this video with using all the tools and everything like that. I'll leave all those links if you guys want to check them out. And if you guys have any questions or comments, as always, definitely drop them in that comment section below, and I'll do my best to respond to all of them quickly and as fast as possible. So if you guys enjoyed this video today and like what you saw, go ahead and smash that like button down below. And if you enjoy content like this and want to see more just like it, consider subscribing to my channel. And don't forget to hit that notifications bell so that you guys will be notified whenever I upload any new videos. With all that being said, everyone, I hope you all stay well, stay safe, and stay healthy. I'll see you next time.